Okay, today is October 20th, 2015. It's about uh, 10.30, 11 a.m. And I'm working with the Kapanazi coil design here, set up. I'm using a Variac plugged into the mains. Not using the battery or the inverter because that battery ain't strong enough to run the inverter. Not using the dimmer, using the Variac. Two caps in parallel. There's a spark gap going to 300 watts. And the ground is coming through Kapanazi coil, going to the high side and the low side. So we got a spark gap. I'm at uh, zero volts, 10, 20, 30, about at 25, starts kicking in. At 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 60, 70, 80, it's almost full bright at 80. even trying to get brighter. I'll blow the bulbs on I know it so I'm gonna cut it back. I'll shut it off. But I believe this will run uh, a whole line of uh, tungsten lamps, filament lamps in series. These are all hooked up in series. And I had the uh, I have a metal rod going through here also trying to create some inductance but I don't really know if it is actually working. Because I can take this coil off and hook it direct to the ground and it'll still come on. So I don't know what the purpose of, of that is. He has the spark gap hooked up on the coil here, pulsing the coil. So uh, <clears throat> my idea, my original goal was to use this 2,000 watt power inverter. I run off the battery which is low and it doesn't have much power much power at all to run the Variac or this transformer now this gets a little warm when it runs and if you leave it on a while it will get hot and start smelling coils in there get hot so I'm going to turn this off the camera and try it again I think I'm letting the battery charge there. Maybe I get a little more juice out of it. I don't know. And see if I can run the very. I can turn it up to 30 volts here, AC, just to see if it'll kick in on this power inverter. It's already hooked up, so I'm going to cut it right here.